your girl's back. Hey y'all, welcome back to another estrogen release video. I am Asia and today's video, I know it's been a while. It's been a long while. I haven't posted in about a year and as you guys know, my last video was my love-hate relationship with social media online. I am trying to evaluate the role that I want social media to play in my life. But it's just, it feels like it's getting more and more toxic. So let's just say that over this past year, I've been hating social media. That's just where I am in this moment. So the, I guess the question is, am I back? I don't know. It's this weird loop that I keep experiencing. It's like, I want to create things that make me happy, that make me feel good, things that I'm proud of, but that typically leads to inconsistency. I also want to post or create in a more full-time environment, um, but that also makes me sad. So yeah, I'm just kind of bouncing back and forth between those two thoughts, those two feelings, trying to figure out what I want to do. So have I figured it out yet? No. Will I ever figure it out? I don't know. I'm not sure but I'm still just trying to go with the flow do me and try my best y'all <laughs> just try my best I'm trying my best I have been pretty active on Instagram um, I post I try to post there but at the same time I'm still focusing on just being present and active in my actual life and doing things that you know make me feel good in my actual life um, as well as live life the best way I know how. So again, that is where I am in this moment. So over the course of this year, 2022, I have been filming, I've been trying y'all, I've been trying, I have been filming videos. However, I just never touched them. I never edited, edited, edit, edited them. They, and I never touched them. They're just collecting dust in my phone. However, I still want to share that with you guys because one thing that I'm learning more and more is that in order to stay away from certain feelings, certain bad feelings, you have to stay active. Life can feel like an uneventful carousel, you know, just like going back and forth, round and round, doing the same thing every single day. Like I legit, I wake up, go to work, come home, eat dinner, get ready for the next day, then do it all over again. And just doing that, it just it doesn't doesn't feel good. I don't think it's good for the soul. It's like a, a mundane loop. One thing that I've experienced more and more is that mundanity, mundanity. Still don't know how to uh, pronounce that correctly, but let's stick with mundanity. Just not good for the soul. It's not a good space to be in. And un unfortunately, you know, life can be you know very boring. I'm a boring person. Ain't no shame in my game, baby. <laughs> pretty laid back and chill. I like to sit at home and do nothing a lot of the times. However, it has its effects, its negative effects. So with that being said, I realized that what gets me away from that loop, that cycle is just trying new things. And that is the vibe of this video is do new things. Get out, experience new stores and restaurants, new areas. Just get out and do something new. Oh my gosh, I haven't filmed in so long. It's very awkward for me to be in front of this camera right now, but we gon' we gonna make it work, baby. We gon' we gonna do it. We gon' we gonna do it. We're gonna do it. Uh this is a very old video. This comes uh this happened in February and it was a girls' weekend. Me, Jasmine, King and Julie, we all got together and just, you know, enjoyed each our time with each other. I, me and Kenya drove down to Jasmine's house because my girl moved into a house. I'm very proud of her and very happy for her. And we just stayed with her. Um, I guess one good update I can give you is that um, I'm a sushi lover now. Magnificent. I can't believe they gave me this much wasabi. 
You usually don't get that much? Mm-mm. I usually get a dot in Maryland. A dot. Are you serious? A dot. Thanks for coming down, guys. Thank you for having us. With all this crap going on with wars and stuff, we gotta spend as much time as we possibly can no, with each serious. other. I don't know what the hell is the motherboards are now. We went to this exotic snack shop. So I found this shop online, Instagram, saved it to my folder and was like, I'm gonna get out there and do it. I'm gonna go out there in one day. So this was like the perfect opportunity. The girls were down with it. And you guys, it was everything that I wanted it to be. Then we went to Smash Burger. This restaurant is actually owned by uh, some people I went to high school with. Technically I went to elementary and middle school with them as well, but people from my school days. Um, they own their own restaurant now and they're doing their thing and I'm very proud of them and happy for them and um, I wanted to go out there to support obviously, but also their burgers look so good, so bomb. So I was like, definitely got to get out there and try that. And we did. So here's some clips from that. Juicy. <laughs> the burgers were amazing like hands down i'm actually craving the burgers but they are all the way out in richmond obviously that's hours away from me so uh when i get out there i'm definitely going to try to make my return but it was very very good so shout out to them and keep doing your thing now for dessert anybody who knows me for real for real for real for real knows that i am all about the dessert like i feel like every day you should have a dessert you deserve a treat like that's just that's my all-time like go-to like i love dessert so again instagram the best place to find new restaurants and things to do i found this place called um Quezon's funnel cakes and i apologize if i'm pronouncing the first name wrong um Quezon, Quezon's, y'all so good so bomb so here are some clips from that gang 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 oh i'm on drugs <laughs> this is a creepy place i love it And you know, there you have it, y'all. Um, that was pretty much the whole weekend. Um, end up going back to Jasmine's house and just chilling. And um, yeah, it was it was it was definitely what I needed. It got me out of the funk that I was in. 
um, and the funk that I tend to go into um, when I just feel very blase and you know unproductive and just yeah again y'all just get out and do new things try something new try something different um, even if it's by yourself just just try to break that cycle try to break that pattern um, it definitely made me feel better so with that being said thank you for watching if you're watching please like comment and subscribe you guys this year has been pretty eventful and like i said i do have some content that i want to share with you all um so please hang in there stay tuned thank you guys for rocking with me this this i think it's been five years since i've had my youtube channel which is really crazy um but yeah thank you so much for being there and yeah hope to see you on the next video so peace bye they're taking a pure electric signal and sculpting it into something of beauty